In this section, we will discuss what databases are and why we use them. All PowerPoints provided are organized by Dr. Farooq Alemi and narrated by Ibtisam al-Bukhari. A database is a collection of data with defined structure and purpose. Data are numbers, text, images, and videos. Data is a representation of information. Information is knowledge that is derived from study experience or instruction. Information is any kind of knowledge that is exchangeable amongst people about things, facts, concepts, and etc. Data in a database can easily be accessed, managed, and updated. Data can be seen in multiple formats such as electronic, printed, graphic, audio, statistical, and used in combination. The manipulation of data is information which can be defined as interpreted data. A database consists of one or more tables. Each table has its own unique name and consists of columns and rows. A column is referred to as a field variable. The rows are records. In this example, one table in the database is shown. The columns position title, educational requirements, functional area, max pay, and min pay are fields. Each row consists of a record. The first row is about executive assistance. They get paid 60,000 maximum pay. The individual cell values in the table are called data. Data can be numbers or text. It can be dates, integer, decimal, or a web URL. Data can be a picture or a link to a picture. If you're familiar with spreadsheets like Microsoft Excel, you're probably already familiar with storing data in tabular form. Each sheet in Excel is a separate table. Each column is a field. Each row is a description of fields for one record. Here, the first row is about John Smith. He is 21 years old at the time the information was inputted. He was born in 1990 in Fairfax. DBMS is an abbreviation for Database Management Systems. A DBMS is a software package with computer programs that control the creation, maintenance, and the use of databases. Examples include Oracle, Microsoft SQL Server, IBM DB2, Infermix, Microsoft Access, Microsoft Fox Pro, MySQL, Borland DBase, and so on and so forth. Users or programmers use the database system to manipulate the data. The database system is a collection of data and systems. The application or query is a programming code that instructs the software to manipulate the data. The software processes the programming instructions, it accesses the data and manipulates it. When it is done, it stores the result of the query back in the database. A database is usually shown as a cylinder to emphasize its role in storing data. To make sure the data is meaningful, the databases usually use metadata which provides information about the meaning of field names in various tables and their relationship to each other. In short, the database system allows the user to manipulate data and make information out of messy collection of interrelated data.